Good afternoon, SGT from one and a half feet away from me. I'm so excited to be next to you, near you. In your atmosphere. What a day. What, what a day. This feels like olden times. It really does. I'm so excited. Well, we are here for a very exciting reason, which is it is the Summer Swat Show, which is, I feel like, where we thrive, honestly. I mean, you know how I feel about summer. You know that this is one of my favorite seasons. And this one is very different than we've ever done before. So remember when I went through all neons and people weren't sure? This feels like <laughs> this feels like an unexpected summer that I feel like people are gonna be very into. We were nothing if not full of range. You know, one summer we took you to camp and this summer we're taking you to Italy. I don't know. I'm summer calling it an upgrade in terms of location. I mean, I'm in Italy in my mind right now. Same. We've been in Italy since we kicked this off. Well, this is the Swatch Show. We show you all of the new colors in the bottle. We show them to you on Swatch Sticks, and then we show them to you um, next to the most similar colors in our portfolio. So you can get a real sense of what each color is all about. And of course, you get priceless commentary from yours truly, but more importantly, from SGT. So here we go. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. Someone just tried to send me something about the secret behind my the chemical behind my McDonald's french fries. And I just want to say, Ooh. I don't appreciate that. That's on a need to know basis and I do not need to know. Do not, do not need to know. Um, well this- Just, just want to kick that off, you guys. I thought you were saying about the secret ingredient of polishes and I was like, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. You're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> it's not that kind of show. It's, it's definitely not this kind of show. But it is the kind of show where you get us unfiltered. So here we are. I'm talking about McDonald's french fries. No parents, no rules. Sorry, SLA. Okay. Um, this collection is Postcard from Paradiso. It is inspired by a summer on the Italian coast. And all of these colors are so bright and bold. And they all have such a cute like story behind them. So let's get into it. It really is, if you were on a vacation in Italy, what would that, what would that feel like? If, it, if Olive and June took you on an influencer trip, should, mm -hmm. should we say. If we were a big enough company, at some point, maybe that's what we'll do, you guys. And everyone will come with us. You know, I, I've tried multiple times to shoot on location and I've been denied for reasons I really don't understand. I don't honestly. understand. I don't understand. We can't, we can't make that happen. Apparently not. Someday, guys. Okay, here we go. I can't even, like, it's like hard to see Star Shower from here. Don't worry. I'll bring it up to the lens. Okay, good. I'm it's so a beaut. Excited. Um, starting over here on my nails as well, because this one might be my favorite, we have Bocce Ball. This is a bright, joyous green. And then we have Flower Pot. Surprise, you thought it couldn't be done, but we gave you a burnt orange in summer. We did, we did. We also gave it to you so you could have it just in time for football season. Mm -hmm. You know, we were like, what if we give it to you too late and then you can't have it for your first game? So we figured out a way. <laughs> it's only been three years later that everybody wants a burnt orange. I know, there's a comment in the club that said, I've given up all hope on a burnt orange and I've saved it and it's been on my desktop and it's been motivating me since the person made the comment and I'm gonna share it later because it made me really happy. Here we are. Um, next we have, how do you spell Bougainvillea? Which cause honestly, how do you spell it? We weren't really sure. Um, then we have star shower, which as SGD mentioned, is um, a really delicate shade. It is a rose gold shimmer. Ah, oh, so good, and so good. Then we have House of O and J, which is this fashion forward, very regal, deep violet, and then not a cloud because as far as I'm concerned, there are no clouds on the Italian coast. There's no clouds in our summer skies. No clouds. All right, let's get into the comparison, shall we? I mean, I'm liking this new light. It is so gorge. New SGT house, new light. New, new, by the way, I've made myself at home already. I've got a snack shelf, everything's going well. Everything yeah. is going quite well. I'm very into these sticks. They remind me of um, like when you would get your rubber bands on your braces. Is that a weird recall? No, that's a good one. By the way, kids in Noah's school are starting, like a year or two older are starting to get braces and they're starting to get rubber bands and I'm like, so excited for her for her like journey was it so competitive when you were growing up like who could wear what color or oh like yes. if your friend already had one and you couldn't have the same i don't know that it was competitive but it was like if you didn't go to a cool orthodontist you just got like lame like you wanted to go to the cool orthodontist that's how they like branded themselves i feel like well now that we're unpacking orthodontist trauma mine couldn't put like sparkles in the retainers mm. and all my friends had sparkly retainers oh i had a lame retainer for mm, sure not my good. parents were like fairly at the orthodontist <laughs> so like i definitely had a lame retainer um and now guys i've gone through 
braces 16 times and I have fake teeth. So, you know, <laughs> make the investment once is my, is my, is my take. Um, if my teeth were all these colors, I'd be a very happy person. Here Same. is, how do you spell Bougainvillea right here in the center? This is a really unique shade because it is pink when it's around pinks and purples when it's around purples. Um, it's closest color comparison, I would say, is wild orchid, but it obviously looks way more purple to the left. Um, I also brought in a couple of our deeper pinks like Cherry Crush and prom and also xoxo all the way to the side look at you bringing in some quick dry you know i just want to keep it spicy for the folks spice. at home spice 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 taffy's in there i mean taffy fierce and loving fierce and loving fierce and loving looks positively lavender i know i know wow. just wait till you see what we got later some some blues are looking gray it's crazy it happens it happens and and you all think that we don't like nuance just kidding you know we love nuance <laughs> I'm actually naming my daughter Nuance. Oh my goodness. By the way, I should have like a cat named Nuance. <laughs> um, I think th if this lettuce is radicchio was, were an opaque shade, I would say that it would be how do you spell bougainvillea because it's that kind of pinky purple beautifulness that we love. So there you go. I'm obsessed. Like How that. do you spell bougainvillea? I mean. Also available in a? Press on. Press on. Which I think I'm gonna put on now. What you don't know is that we're filming this a few weeks prior. When is this launch? Uh, May 14th, 13th? May 14th. I might pop these on now. I'm just saying, can't be stopped. Cannot be stopped. Cannot be stopped. Alrighty, moving right along to House of O&J. This is like a very Versace scarf purple that makes us all very happy. I just wanna say, House of Gucci, if you haven't read the book, which of course is like what I think about when I think of House of OJ. House of Gucci, if you've not read the book, is so good, you guys. Like, read it. I mean, I know some people watch the show or whatever, a show, movie, miniseries, whatever it was. Oh, I Lady didn't. Gaga, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, I didn't. I Neither just did. read the book. And the book is incredible. We uh, should have book club. We should do a book club. Book club. We should do a book club. Um, okay, here's House of O and J. Again, really not unlike, like, very special color. I would say it's like a deeper version of Royal, which just launched mm -hmm. from our Quick Dry collection. Um, but we have a lot of warm purples. You know, Plaza goes quite warm. Mulberry, TLG goes quite warm. Grape Plaza doesn't soda. Go that warm. Do you think it does? I mean, in this context, it kind of looks like obsessed to me, don't you? Oh, think? yeah, it does. You're right. You're right. I and mean, you're right. You're right. Here's Prairie looking gray. By the way, what you guys don't know is I paint these and then I plan them all out and then I have full mental breakdowns confused about what colors actually are. And I know. If you didn't write those colors, like if we did a test, it would be like, you'd have to like think about it. Yeah. I'd have to be like, what is my name? <laughs> That cough, that cough is still, what is, what is your, <laughs> name? your name? What is your name? Um, An inside joke at all of in June. It's, that's, a, that's a deep cut. I know that, but that's, a, that's like a three and a half year call back. That was a day one. SLA. SLA. Anyway, so here's she, she the doesn't watch these. She doesn't know that we're making fun of her. I know. Yeah, it's true. Sorry, um, SLA. We do love you very much. Oh, yeah. No, I mean, like, SLA like, is our boss. So, like, we have respect. It's just she, like. Yeah, yeah. She's definitely the boss. Zach the boss. All right. The... Everyone thinks I'm the boss. They're wrong. <laughs> They're wrong. Here's the color y'all have been waiting years and years for. Flower pot. It is a burnt orange inspired by, you know, like those gorgeous terracotta pots that, you know, house happy little herbs and flowers and stuff. A color that I may never wear that will probably be a bestseller. Yes. Honestly, here's the thing. If they don't make this a bestseller, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with myself. I don't know either, because all I've been hearing about is burnt orange, burnt orange, burnt orange. Yeah. So if this is not the first color that sells out, oh no. Could so if you, don't, if you don't buy this color, we're just going to make nuanced pinks for the rest of our lives. And nuanced, like, creams. Mm, mm hmm And beige. Different shades of... Brown. Righto. Threw a couple wild cards in here as well. We're not, we're not, a, we're not afraid to get spicy. Oh, yeah, speaking of spicy. Ah, oh, JJ is such a good color. Just as a side note. All right, here we go. So, um, Southwest was, I mean, I, in my opinion, we have a lot of kind of terracotta -y pumpkin colors. I know y'all don't feel that way. And some of you accuse me of not knowing what a pumpkin was, but I digress. Um, but South you didn't say that comment either. No, 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 I don't look at that one before I go to bed and no. like hope that my mom is proud of me. Um, never. Never. Uh, never <laughs> Southwest um, is a lot more red here. It almost is like kind of rusty. And then Flower Pot is that sort of more true burnt orange. 
MG is sort of more rosy. Our good friend Kendra starts small. I brought in our true kind of oranges. I brought in your 10 because it's a little bit dusty and so is this one. Sweet and Gracious looks like Dijon mustard to me nowadays because it's so yellowy orange. J.O. from our fall 2020 collection. You know, I do think Flower Pop would be a very good pedicure for me. She loves a neutral petty. Oh, I do. She does. I do. Um, Caribou Budino, Howdy, and JJ to round us all out in the kind of orangey brown category. Gorgeous. So good. We are flying today, my friend. We really are. I'm putting this swatch on. I mean, I can get down with Flower Pot as a mani too, probably. Three coats, though. Three coats. Three I need coats. a fully saturated color. Deepen it up. Deepen it up. Yeah. All right, bocce ball, which I'm picking. Oh, bocce ball, get out of here. Best color ever. I'm picking favorites, because I'm not I'm in so annoyed this is not a press on. I'll be, <laughs> I'll be pushing for this in the future. Yeah, we should bring it back for the spring break collection. House of O&J, a press on, coming soon. We're gonna show you at the end, y'all. Mm-hmm. Bocce ball's so good. Bocce ball, again, so different from any other green we've ever done. I brought in a lot of friends, but really nothing compares. Ugh, lime fizz. Lime fizz. Underrated color. Justice for lime fizz. Justice. Justice for neons, you guys. They're much more wearable than you give them credit for. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Um, it's interesting you bring up lime fizz, SGT, because bocce ball has a similar sort of demi matte dry down to lime fizz because it's so powerfully packed with pigment. So if your eyes are making it seem a little bit matte when you get it, your eyes are not deceiving you. Oh, so you have to use. You have to use glossy top coat. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. same, same, same. It I, is. I find those colors not annoying because like once you put the top coat on, you're really into them, but you've got to keep a top coat handy if you're going to be traveling with those colors because you're going to have to re-top re coat it every like, if you're not an every other day person, like by day five, you got to re-top coat it. Mm -hmm. But that's how we get that perfect pigment, so. And it's so, you It's know, worth the payoff. The way it's bright, I think you can see when you have them next to each other that it's almost like there's a light behind Lime Fizz and Bocce Ball that aren't mm -hmm. behind the other ones, so. Mm -hmm. Pretty epic. I mean, this color is my life. Okay. All right. But I yeah. mean, you picked a favorite. It's, it's uncomfortable, but. I did pick a favorite, yeah. But I got to own it, you know? I think it's important. I think it's important just to, you know, I pick favorites all the time. Because yeah. normally you're much, you're much more... Inclusive on that. Well, there's no purple. Well, there's a purple. There's no light purple, so. so oh, yeah, there's no your invited comp dupe. Yeah. The yeah. nuance, that's what the new collection is going to be. Just a bajillion <laughs> nuances of your invited oh, and lavender stones. Literally, it'd be your favorite collection of all time. Alrighty. Almost, almost done. Here is not a cloud. So pretty. I'm excited for everyone's thoughts on this one because I really don't think any of these colors are like anything that we have. Not to toot our own horns, you know, but also to toot our own horns. I mean, a toot toot. If you're not going to toot your own horn, who's going to, you know? I mean, I'll toot it up. Can't <laughs> lose. Good color. Underrated as well. Underrated. Yeah, I got a little wild pulling ones for this too, but I just wanted to show how different it was. I know, because often people will be like, it's the same as X, and it's like, it never is. You think we don't think about this? Like, literally, we like, we just like agonize over it. Yeah, this is like my hobby. You know, some people like play bridge. I do this. I want to learn how to play Mahjong. Oh, my mother plays Mahjong. I would like to learn. I played bingo last night, y'all, and I basically want to be 80 years old. I was going to say, you are 100. I'm ready. I'm ready. <laughs> um, I'm ready to be, be, be like a Palm Beach grandma. What if we did like a like a retirement theme for our birthdays this year? Oh my goodness! I, all I want to do is be retired. We'll do like instead of it's a birthday party, it's like a retirement. Oh Sunday. my goodness, you guys! I can't even tell you. Um, too bad I'm too type A to be retired. Oh yeah, no, but just like so you could dress up like an old person. Totally, and like wear like a floral muumuu and eat soft foods. Oh, in, <laughs> in. Um, speaking of what life is like when you're retired, not a cloud in the sky. Um, this yeah, not a cloud in the sky when you're retired. No, no clouds, no rain. Um, closest comp I would say is a darker version of Mega Bay Blue. Boost goes a lot more kind of cornflower, and then everybody else is just very different. C and H is like denim indigo. BP looks white. Vintage looks gray. Blueberry Smash looks kind of teal. Everybody's all over the place. I love this color. It's really pretty. It's not my favorite, but I love it. 
I feel like you will like randomly pull out like a blue mani for like a couple days. I love a blue mani. Just I for love vibes. a blue mani. I'm not saying it's not my favorite blue. Mm. I'm just saying how how do you spell bougainvillea is just so good. I felt I'm falling in love with I also like House of Owen Jay. Mm -hmm, I'm mm -hmm. kind of feeling more traditional, like what you all usually like. Although it's probably because I'm just like reacting to flower pot. Right. Yeah. We had we had you in our heads the whole time, always. I mean, kind of you do, and then you guys did flower pot. What was the other name for flower pot that we didn't go with? I mean, so that you wanted funny. that I was like, oh, oh, we wanted to call it summer surprise in Italian, but because we were like, they'll be so surprised that it'll be a burnt orange in summer, but. I don't think I was into that. We didn't think that that was, that was like too inside, inside. Yeah, I don't think I was into that, you guys. Um, you know what we're into though? Toppers, shimmers, and all things that are shiny. And we're gonna round it all out with Star Shower, which is the rose gold fraternal twin of Cosmic. So exact same, kind of shimmer particle as cosmic, but in rose gold. So it has this beautiful warmth to it. You know those like yummy body oils that have that like little bit of shimmer in them? Yeah. That's what this makes me feel like. It just feels- It always makes me worried that if I put them on, then like it's gonna get all over my car. Yeah. But does it? No, I don't, mm. you know, you have a little shimmer, like, like fairy was here. Right, well, so a little bit it does. A little bit it does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so a couple of things I brought in to compare Star Shower to, although as you can see on this video, it's super subtle, which it is. Um, Party Pants is our rose gold glitter. So I brought in a rose gold friend, Cosmic, of course, right next to it. Abbi is our kind of holographic yellow gold glitter. And then Fairy is the newest shimmer topper from Quick Dry, just so you can see that all of these in fact have a clear base and then a little shimmer floating around inside. Beautiful. Gorge. Gorge. All right, let's do some press on, shall we? Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's start with this one because I think actually they're gonna freak out. All right. Well, y'all loved the velvet nails that we did with Heart and so we are very excited to introduce velvet fig swirls for summer. These are a mixed pack of some velvet fake uh, French tips, some kind of like swirly things over here, and then a couple solids. This has that like velvet or also known as cat eye kind of treatment to it. And the base is that semi sheer beautifulness that makes it look like a stunning, I don't know, set of acrylics that took you four hours to apply, but you just popped on in minutes. Minutes, the instant mammy. Uh, and these are short round. This next one is one of my faves because it is so Italian summer. This is, this is a work of art, my friends. I love this one. Um, ah, and it matches the box, it's perfect. It does, it does. Italian tile French, another mixed pack of um, things inspired by tiles and like the level of detail on this is insane. It literally would take you six hours mm -hmm. in a slump, but really you're just gonna pop it out in minutes. And then these two that I think are I think there's, I think they're twin, they're fraternal twins. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I'd like to present them together. Okay, presented as fraternal twins. We've got Medium Almond House of O and J, which is a solid. Oh, gorge. Inspired by the polish. And then we have this rad chrome purple gradient medium oval. So it's like this really delicate um, gradient from full purple down to like a sheer. Neutral. I'm obsessed with that one. Very cool. And then I'm gonna go, I'm, these are my two faves. These are like my oh, two, two faves. She's but picking I'm, faves. I wanna be clear that I like them all and I'm going to wear them all as you know, because Sarah, you know I go at press A. Sarah Gibson, I don't pick favorites total. I yeah. know, I know. But this one I think is my second favorite, but I don't know, they're equal kind of. I'm, it's hard to pick a fave. On a bet, I would not have picked this as your favorite. I know, I love it so much. Wow. I am, I gotta, I gotta restudy because this was not what I would have picked. I know, it's so. very pink, which you know I'm not normally a pink person, but I am with this. She's spicy, this is pink party French, so if you ever needed to start a party in a pack, here you go. I also love a French, mm. and this one is like such a, like, intricate design that rolls up the side. I think it's just like, it's really special and different. I think it brings French to the next level, and then you have that, like, you have that nail or two on each hand that is, it's solid, which I love. I just, I love a mixed up 
pack. I just think it's so cool. The solid really grounds you. I agree with that. And then my faves, my absolute faves. Oh but, my, by the way, is this a pink? I mean, it is kind of, it's like a purpley pink. It is a purpley pink. Here we have, how do you spell bougainvillea? in a medium oval shape. By the way, if you're wondering why SGT's favorites come in a certain shape, I'm not gonna name names, but. I mean, but I'm not not. I'm not not gonna name names. Um, here's how you spell bougainvillea in press on form. In polished form. I mean. It's okay, wait. it's the end of the video. Yeah. We're getting towards the end. Speaking of the end of the video, you did something very cool for the community. With when you when you type in a certain code. Oh my god, I'm gonna type it. I would literally look at you like I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, I didn't mean to scare you. By the way, she's looking at me with a lot of fear behind her eyes. No, but like I was like, I do a lot of things, <laughs> and I love to give things away for free. Who as does? you know. Do you remember what the code is? I don't know if I remember what the code is. It starts with a P. Well, I was gonna say pizza. Oh, I really, I did not make that easy for you. It's pasta. It's pasta. I know. I really, but in my mind, I was like, it's not pizza. I really set it you is. up for failure there. I I'm know. Sorry. So don't put in pizza. It's pasta. Code By the pasta. way, which I prefer more than pizza, if I'm being honest. I was going to say, I was trying, I mean, I guess you could make both gluten-free. I don't know. Where... I don't know. I don't know. It's the end of the Gluten-free pretzel is always good, by the way. I just want to say. Um, yes, if you enter code pasta with your order. You get a free? Polish. Yay! Just kidding, you get a free pizza. Just kidding, no you don't. Just kidding, no you don't, we don't make pizza. I mean, it's just not, we, could we DIY pizza? Okay, we're gonna keep you going. You lost the plot. Anyway, thanks for joining us. Always a pleasure. Hope you love this collection. Leave us a comment. I love you so much. We can't wait to see your manis. Happy summer. Bye. Bye.